Time passes by so quickly. It doesn't seem so long since Amy was born. And here I am speaking at a wedding. Amy's a, a wonderful daughter, a very caring person. She's given me a lot of joy and happiness. And I'm gonna say, me and Amy, we've got a special bond. It's been forged over me sat beside her cot <laughs> for eight hours in every 12 <laughs> for the first two years of our life. Martin, you love that Amy is the most caring, warm-hearted person you know. You love that she's completely selfless and always thinks of others first. Martin loves Amy's smile and that she always knows exactly what to say to cheer him up when he's having a bad day, sometimes without even meaning it. He's a very active person, as are all his next of kin. <laughs> Whereas she likes lazy days, he'll still drag her to the gym. He romances her and dines her, home-cooked dinners and the like. He even knows her favourite food and spoils her day and night. She's thoughtful when he looks at her, a smile upon his face. Will he look that good in 50 years when his dentures aren't in place? <laughs> he says he loves her figure and her mental prowess too, but when gravity takes over, will she charm with her IQ? <laughs> she says she loves his kindness and his patience is a must. And of course she thinks he's handsome, which in her eyes is a plus. Amy, you love the way Martin makes you feel happy and makes you feel yourself and always tells you how beautiful you are. She loves he knows her inside out, sometimes even better than she knows herself. He is her best friend and Amy can talk to Martin about anything, even although she knows that a lot of the time he's just pretending to listen. <laughs> So, now to say some words about the star of the show. <laughs> My beautiful bride, Amy. <laughs> I said at the start of this speech that I'd try and not be soppy and say how she's my soulmate, my best friend, the love of my life, but in all honesty, all of that is true. I couldn't imagine spending the rest of my life with anybody else.